I'd just like to people to believe, I think they do believe, well I hope they do, that I actually do care. A lot. The minute a band walks through the door, they're like my baby. It's an interesting juxtaposition of uh, technology and creativity. It's probably, I think, one of the weirdest jobs in the world. I'm not sure if I can think of many other jobs where you have to combine so many different disciplines. You have to be able to relate to people. You have to be able to solve their problems. You have to be competent with music. That doesn't mean to say you have to be a competent musician, but you have to be competent with music. And then if you're stepping from the sound engineer into the producer's shoes, you have to have a certain amount of authority because the book then stops with you. Uh, you have to understand how to realise the artist's dreams. I always try to be as inclusive as humanly possible. So if there's a problem or if there's something particularly good, I always try to make sure the band understand. But deep down I know if I brown it won't help the way they leave a session uh, a better band uh, because I think they learn more about how their music works. I get ecstatic emails from the bands, you know, the members of the bands. That's like brilliant. And sometimes that goes on to be even better because they might get radio play and people get to hear it. I mean it's the music that I care about. I like it. Music's just part of the soul. This has been a guide to life by Fresh Idea Productions. <laughs>